Hi Kyle, my name is Michelle. I spoke on the phone with Cody today who told me to send this video over to you. I am just calling local carpet cleaners in your area, going over your websites with you, showing you how to get new leads just from your website, as well as discuss your overall online presence. So, I do have some background in digital marketing, and I can tell you that Google looks at three specific aspects when ranking websites along their Google platform. Number one, and probably the most important factor for organic movement of your website, is going to be content. And content is anywhere that actual text shows up on your site. So you have a little there. And that's about it. So not a whole lot of content. So let me, um, let me tell you why content is so important, as well as give you a quick example. Anytime you do a basic Google search for anything specific, Wikipedia always is your number one search return. Why is that? It's because it has so much content. So every few weeks, Google does a sweep of the internet, finds content-rich sites, and naturally just starts moving them up the rankings. Knowing this, as well as doing some research for some of your competitors in the area, I would recommend you have between 1,000 and 1,500 words of content on your homepage alone. This is going to do a few things for you. It's going to allow you to be found by Google whenever they do their sweep, as well as outrank any competition you have in the area. With that said, on every additional page, we usually recommend between 750 to 1,000 words of content. And I'm sure you're not too far off that um, just by looking here. But in doing so, that does two things. By making sure we have enough content on every page, we know that Google loves content, right? So we're adding to the amount of content we have on our website. However, for every keyword we want to rank for, it has to be surrounded by 250 words of content. This is part of that Google algorithm that a lot of people don't know. So having a lot of content to rank for a lot of keywords is going to be important for you to be found as well as allow Google to point back to you on several different searches. We kind of go over that a little bit more. This here is Ahrefs and it just gives me a breakdown of how you're doing on the internet. As you can see we're not getting a ton of traffic to our website currently. Part of that is from the amount of keywords you're ranking for. If I look here your best position is at the very bottom of page one for better clean. Um, so 60 people are you know, searching that every month. You're not quite getting two people from that. And that's about the best um, word that you're ranking for currently. So having a lot of uh, keywords that we're ranking for is going to help us get found more often because the number of searches that people do a month like 150 people right now are searching carpet cleaning Asheville and you're at the bottom of page four. So in this day and age, people just don't search and dig a lot to find what they're looking for. They usually don't go beyond page one. So securing a page one presence is going to be crucial to getting people to your website. And we do that by ranking for more keywords. So let's get more keywords put into those content um, that's on your pages, specifically on your service pages, so that we can rank you for several different keywords, okay? Next, let's have a look at these two numbers for you. This UR here is directly related to citations. And when I do a basic Google search for your area, the very first thing that pops up is this Google Map. And as you can see right here, these top three competitors are going to get the most business based on visibility alone, which is what every business owner wants, right? We want our information and our business name to be in front of as many people as possible. So how do we secure a top position here? That's going to be through adding citations. And a citation is anywhere that your business name, address, and phone number show up in some sort of online directory. So think Yelp or Yellow Pages. There's hundreds of them out there, so the more that you can get, the higher up this ranking you're going to go. In doing so, you're going to cause this number to go up, and I'll tell you about these numbers here in just a minute. Lastly, let's talk about this DR. DR is directly related to backlinks. And a backlink is anywhere that you have a clickable link back to your website on another business's website. So think Angie's List or HomeAdvisor.com. Having good quality referring domains that have a lot of traffic um, host our backlink is going to throw a lot of their influence back to us, which is also going to cause this DR number to go up. When both of these numbers are going up, 
you're going to create a lot of linear stability for your business. As you can see, you've kind of been on a steady decline uh, over the last three months, and um, this is just going to throw a lot of stability towards your position and help you hold on to your rankings a lot better, meaning you won't be bumped out of your position as easy, um, which is definitely what we want. So businesses who are ranking high in your area currently have high UR, DR, and keywords. Having all three of those are going to provide a lot of increased traffic to your website. Well, I hope this information was helpful. If you find it useful, please let me know. Send me a quick email. Let me know what you thought. I would greatly appreciate it. But for now, that's all I have. Hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will be in touch soon. Bye-bye.